your girl Nunu the Hair Diva and I'm back with you once again with a video. This video is going to be a compilation of a couple of little things that I wanted to make sure I went on ahead and showed you and talked to you about before the year has ended. Today is December 30th and hopefully, hopefully you will be watching this video sometime on New Year's Eve. I want to wish everyone a very happy, blessed, wonderful, successful, lots of money, lots of love, peace and joy, happy new year. And yeah, let's go on ahead and get started. So in this video, I wanted to talk to you about some hair care products that I had purchased a while back. For me, I don't have to use uh, hair care products, you know, for like two, three months to see what's going on. Just a couple of times, at least three to four times for me to understand if it's going to be a good product or not. So I definitely want to talk to you about those items, what I liked and what I decided I didn't like. Also in this video, I wanted to show you the uh, Amazon purchases that I got um, that I didn't receive in enough time to show you in the last video. Uh, what else I wanted to talk to you about? I did a little bit of shopping. Y'all, my camera broke. So we're going to start off with that. I don't know how this is going to look until I record it and then go back and look at it, but this is a new camera because new news camera broke. So this is the camera that I was initially recording off of. It's a Sony Handycam and my daughter, uh, my oldest daughter brought this for me probably like four years ago. And I don't know if it was refurbished, but we got it from Best Buy. I do know that the box was open, and by chance, I actually kept this. This is how much the camera was and the type of camera that um, I picked up. So, yes, the box was open. It could have been refurbished. It was $89.99, and the original price was $249. So, um... There was no missing accessories and no damage. So, yeah, it was wonderful. And let me just put that here. This is what the handy camera looked like. And it had a built-in charger. And, yeah, I loved it. And the problem that I was having, when you cut it on, as you can see, it is a white face, but I'm going to have to turn the camera like this. In order to be able to see me very up and close, you had to turn down the uh, viewfinder. And if I turned it back up, look at what it did. Yeah, so I had to go on ahead and purchase a new one or else I wasn't going to be able to do my videos and... I got to be able to do my videos. So on Amazon, I went and looked for another Sony Handycam because these cameras work good for me. It does what I wanted to do. It has a built-in uh, SD card. Well, it has a slot for it. So the one that I picked up was this Handycam HDR CX405. And this is what it looks like. And obviously, I can't show you the camera because I am recording on it. It also came with a 64 gig SD card. So let me just show you the sizes of the boxes. Can you see? Can you see that? Yeah. So the old camera definitely was a lot larger than the new camera. So yeah, I had to get that and I got it in two days. So that's the first bit of drama. Well, the last bit of drama, hopefully for 2017. So that's the camera. Um, I also picked up this mouse. Oh my goodness, do y'all see that? It's an owl. 
it is so cute it is a wireless mouse from Logitech and it has a little owl pattern on it the one that I had before it was dying out so you know it, it was the year of changing electronic products so that's what was going on alright now the ColourPop item because I remember saying I did have some ColourPop here is my ColourPop uh, bag and everything I opened already I even have the makeup on my face I just toss that there because I will be putting it back I picked up two Super Shock shadows and two of the lippy sticks so the Super Shock shadows that I picked up one was in the name Mittens and the other one was in the name Bandit and I will show you my nails I did them for New Year's so Mittens is kind of like a dark brown with a reddish hue it is very very pretty kind of like a satin finish I have it all over my mobile lid I thought this was really pretty back when I had it before but it dried out and I mean a whole year or so went by and I you know hadn't repurchased it so I will show you what my eyes look like and I have this one too and this is Bandit and Bandit is a good crease color as well as all over the lid and Bandit is a lighter brown but this brown has a little bit of yellow and a little bit of orange on the inside as well and I really love these two colors um, I could use them as everyday colors I'm putting things away so you know the video gonna be long <laughs> I use these as everyday colors as well and let me show you and zoom in to show you what it looks like on my eyes so this is what my eyeshadow looks like and the crease area is I believe banded and the lid area is mittens really really like that all right now the two lippy sticks that I have I picked up a daydream which is a matte as well as boys town which is a cream and this is boys town and I just wanted some kind of nudes and it's like a nudie pink and it's really cute I do like that um, I wanted to try to get out of some of the matte liquid lipstick so I picked that one up and this is called daydream and this is more of a warmer tone of that color as you can see and when I purchased these it was like the last day where you could buy one get one free so I only spent ten dollars plus shipping and handling which was like $4.95 and got uh, four items so those are the two colors of the lippy sticks all right so let's see what else is going on now for Amazon what I picked up at Amazon was a part of skincare now if you remember my last haul video I told you that I have brought some more items for skincare but these are items to help me with my skincare. So the larger box is this item here, and it is a facial steamer, and it's by Kingdom Cares. And the box on the outside is blue, and they had a blue one, but by the time I was ready to purchase it, they didn't. So, you know, Nunu was upset about that. So, even though I'm not a true fan of pink, we all know that, I decided to go for the purple tone. And this is how big it is. And this is what the top of it looks like. Now, my friend Mary, she is here on YouTube as well, Mary Ferguson. Uh, we talked about these and she had a facial steamer not the exact same thing but you know similar 
and this one shoots the steam out so you don't have to put your face directly into it it is very lightweight and it has a handle it has a very long cord and it has like the velcro to help you keep the cord together this back piece here comes out and this is where you will put your water and as you can see I have used it already I just wanted to wait for my camera to record everything and I love it if you cannot stand kind of medium to medium hot steam coming to you directly in the face don't get it but I, I do I love showering and kind of like very hot water this works and I wanted to use it after uh, I did my three-step cleansing system then steam my skin and then I will go in with either a face mask or my uh, serums and eye creams and things like that so that it can really get deep down into my pores all you have is this one button here up is for on and of course down is for off and it also gives you um, instructions and things like that a warranty and this little pink uh, bow is a hair bow that you can put around your hair so let me put this back in the box I really really love this I will link this below I got it from Amazon it came in two days as well I didn't order everything at the same time so little by little these things dwindled in well actually this didn't come in two days because I ordered it around about the Christmas time Christmas delivery but I couldn't get it until after that so that is the Kingdom Cares facial steam and if I'm not mistaken it comes in about four colors and if y'all see the blue one y'all message me below because I will buy the blue one and then give that to one of my daughters all right so this next item that I picked up also from Amazon this is the who are you by beauty star electric and it is um, it's for your pores I'm trying to see how you say this thing it's a suction tool so this is what it looks like and let me just take it out of the box and slide it out of the box here now if you have very oily skin and you get whiteheads blackheads pimples things like that this will help you to get all of that extra oils and things like that off of your skin now one I'm not a dermatologist I just I have used items like these before years ago not of the same quality but I have used them and you know I want to take care of my skin you know what I'm saying I want to look like the new 30s even though we not in the 30s no more so this is how it comes you have your device here Ooh, Lord, what was that okay so that was a USB cord and I could pick that up which lets you know it is uh, rechargeable and it's a uh, fill baby that's the name down there this is the device it has seven let's see one two three four five different functions and uh, or strengths for how it suctions and you have these other little uh, devices here which some are specifically for around your nose area some are for your forehead and cheek area some are for around your eyes and they go from small from very small to very large and then you have the charging dock as well so I haven't used this and I'll pick up that USB cord when the video is done I haven't used this because I just got this uh, I believe today in the mail, no yesterday in the mail and I wanted to show it to you and this is going to be a part of my skin tear skin care not tear the new <laughs> skin care on a regular basis and if you want to know 
the skincare that I'm using. If you want to see me use these items and how they work, definitely let me know that in the comments below and I will do that. So the last part of what I wanted to show you for my skincare, before I get into the hair care, I uh, went to Ulta because um, it's still my birthday month and in your birthday month, you can get um, a $10 off coupon. They usually give you uh, a free makeup item and then depending on your status, if you just like a, I guess like a beauty advisor or something like that, or platinum, you can get two, three, or five times the points. So I was able to get actually seven times the points. How did I do that? I will let you know. Everything on Ulta was already two times the points for everyone. Then... During my birthday month, I was able to get an additional five times the points. I am a platinum member. To become platinum, you only need to spend $450. And trust me, that is four to five purchases, depending on, you know, give or take all the things that you want. So it ain't hard to become platinum there. With that being said, the free item that I got was this IT Cosmetics uh, Superhero Elastic Stretch Volume Mascara. And as you see, it says happy birthday on there. So this is what I got free. I've never used it. It's a mini, but I've always heard people talk about it. So I have that and I think I'm good on mascara y'all. I mean there's like two from MAC that I want but I think I'm good on mascaras. And I went in there because the skincare that I'm using is Clinique. I love them. I have so many items from them and if you want to know more about Clinique from me, what I like, what I don't like, let me know below. I'm trying to have new videos for the new year that's more interesting for you guys. So leave me comments below of what you want to see. So Clin Clinique actually had 25% off all of their gift sets. So I found this gift set in there and it is their skincare line. And um, I wanted to find the eye cream because the eye cream that I have from them, um, I like it. I, I really do like it, but the formula of it is what I don't like. I prefer gel over the cream. So this here was a retail value of $107. The suggested value uh, was $64. Then there was 25% off for that. $10 off and then seven times the point. So y'all added up. Mm -hmm. So what I picked up, and I can't wait to start to use it, is the Clinique uh, Smart Repair Broad Spectrum 15 Custom Repair Moisturizer. And this is the full size, which I was so happy to get. So it was almost like purchasing this and getting everything else free and then you have the custom repair now this is the day cream this is the night cream and then these are the eye creams and so this is the custom repair serum right here and this is the custom repair eye cream all right so that's everything in there so, so far, so good on the skincare. I think, you know, I'm good and I can hold off from, you know, buying more skincare. Let me use what I got so that if you want a video, I can give you more in-depth de details about it. All right, now y'all know I'm trying to keep this lipstick off my teeth. So if you see it, let me know. So, you know, we don't want to take that trend into next year. All right, now, here we go with the hair care. Okay, but before that, let me show you my nails. So this is what I did for my nails, just basic. 
I reused this design here. You remember that from Instagram. And I painted my nails in like this little orange color and I put a matte top coat on this one. I left this one glossy and um, I had all these little dots and things like that. It was like a six piece set. So this is kind of like my uh, bubbly pops of color. I put 2018 on here, but I messed up the eight because, you know, I'm right-handed. And the thumb, I just left regular. So those are my nails, and they are definitely growing quite long again because y'all know I had to cut them down. On this hand, because I want to show you the thumb last, I did pretty much the same thing. I mattified this one. I redid this nail to look kind of like the purple one, but I used my favorite colors, two blues. Left this one plain, left this one plain, and this one, this thumbnail, do y'all see how long that is just from right there? This thumbnail, to me, was the best. So let's see. It says Happy New Year. And to me, it's the best. And then I put those same little uh, bubble gems on the bottom to make it look, you know, as festive as it possibly could. I got lots of compliments on my nails. And yeah, I am really, really digging them. And I didn't want nothing too much. All right, so now. Don't know how long this video is, but we're going to keep on going. Now, I received a coupon from Influencer. Information about Influencer will be in the description bar below. So that I could try an item free. The item that I picked up was the Eva NYC Therapy Sessions Hair Mask. Okay, so far, as you can see, my hair has been straightened again. Uh, so far, this is not a hair mask that I would recommend you go out and try. Why am I saying that? I, I'm a cosmetologist. I do a lot of people's hair. I do my own hair, my children and grandchildren. And this hair mask, to me, sits on your hair. It is. Well, first of all, it doesn't smell that good. And I don't know if hair masks should, but yeah, it, it, it doesn't smell good at all. And, and because it doesn't smell good, doesn't mean it doesn't work. As you can see, if I hold it, you can see I have used it. And I have used this, I want to say three times since the last time um, I showed it to you as a new item. Why I used it that day, um, I came back to tell you guys about it. Then I colored my hair, as you can see, no gray, thank the Lord. And um, I used it again. And what I noticed was it sits on my hair. It definitely doesn't have any slip at all, none. It made my hair almost feel like it was matting together and not in a, matting isn't, there's no way for that to be good any kind of way. So at first I wanted to get another one, but then I was like, no, this is not really that good. So I am going to use it up, but how I'm using it is I'm mixing it with uh, another item that I recently purchased and that's this uh, Carol's Daughter Almond Milk Daily Damage Repair Ultra Nour Nourishing Hair Mask. Now this stuff right here, child, child. Mm-hmm. Now it smells like almond milk or almost like cocoa butter. Yeah, but not in a bad way. And as you can see, if I bring that right there, can y'all see that? Yeah, because I don't want it to spill out. I have used this stuff. This stuff here has slipped to it. You can put it on your hair and detangle with your fingers. This, your fingers not going through nothing. No, do you hear nothing? 
So what I would do is put this on first to make sure that um, I had my hair saturated with it, but you know, it's a little longer, so I had to use more and get it all the way through and then comb it through. And then I would take the Eva NYC and I would put that around my hairline and my ends. And then after doing that, I would just smooth it all in, put a plastic cap on my head and just sit and watch some YouTube videos and hopefully didn't fall asleep on it. So these two work, this makes this work a little better. But this by itself, I will not repurchase it, but I will finish this one up. This here, if your local CVS still has this, buy it. They have been selling them at 75% off. Um, I know Budget Madam, she's here on the YT. She went and brought a plethora. Do you hear me? Probably the whole shelf. She got plenty of them and I went back and I picked up two more of these and one more of the leave-in conditioner. So yes, that's how that works. Now, this item here I received from Influencer as well, which is also Eva NYC. This is the Main Magic 10-in-1 Primer. And it has uh, argon oil and sunflower seed oil. And it's for all hair types. And it's probably about that much left in there. All right, how I use this. After I uh, blew my hair dry using other products that I will be showing you, I would spray this on before I put my flat iron on just to give my hair like a little bit of oil, a little bit of shine. It's not necessarily a heat protectant, but it did leave my hair very soft and shiny and I didn't have to keep adding more and more oil to my hair to try to keep it moist because you know it's cold so our hair is drying out a little more. This hair was so good, so good that the coupon that I had was for $3 off. I went and brought the full size and I got it at Ulta. The full size is $11.99. The coupon that I had was $3 off. It made it $8.99. Don't forget, I got seven times the points on that. And I mean, this right here, yeah. I saw that they had one more left $11.99 is not a lot to me, so I may go on ahead and go back and purchase that. They supposed to sell this at Ulta, at Target, and some other areas, but not every, and CVS, but CVS doesn't carry it. So you might have to check your local Ulta. Um, I didn't check Target, so I can't verify that it's actually there, but Ulta does have it, and yeah maybe tomorrow I'll go and get the other one because when something works and I like it I like to have two of them y'all know that about me I'm a twin so for some reason I gotta have two of everything I don't know why okay these items here I showed all three of these items in a haul video and what I use for my hair this item here is the L'Oreal Paris Advanced Hair Styling Sleek It. It is an iron straight hairspray up to 450 degrees. This I really do enjoy. I love the spray on it. Um, it doesn't detangle your hair, but if you have to spray it on your hair after blow drying, it doesn't wet your hair down where you can't apply the flat iron right after it. So this is something I really do like. It says three days sleep. You can use it for all hair tools. It's a 5.7 uh, fluid ounce. I really like this. I am going to buy this again, but I will wait until, you know, I finish or I get awfully low on it. These two items here are the Not Your Mother's uh, All Eyes on Me 10-in-1 Perfector, and this is in a Heartbeat Blow Dry Spray. 
Lord, y'all. Now, I know there are blow-dry sprays out there, and I have used some that were quite expensive, like in the upwards of $20. A blow-dry spray helps you to blow your hair dry faster without using um, excessive heat to give yourself heat damage. And I'm gonna tell you something, this right here, not only does it smell good, but it definitely works. And the item that I used it with, it, it worked even fabulous with that item. I love the sprayer on it. Um, it's kind of thick in there. It doesn't spray out thick, but it does spray out a little white on your hair, but nothing that's going to stay on your hair and look and have like a residue or anything like that. I really do enjoy it. I think it was like $5.99. Unheard of to me to buy a blow dry spray that cheap. I say go get it. Get it at Ulta. Get you some points. There you go. This right here um, is the All Eyes on Me 10 in 1 Perfector. It's infused with keratin. Now, this is almost like a detangler, a heating spray. Um, it adds body, strengthens, detangles, moisturizes, adds shine, controls fit, frizz, <laughs> repairs dry hair, heat protect, men split ends, and seals cuticles. So, what I would do is and, and I, I don't want damaged hair because it's finally growing. I would spray on the blow dry spray first. Then I would spray on the All Eyes on Me 10 in 1 Perfector. Then I would go in with the heat protectant spray. And then I would just start blow drying my hair. After blow drying my hair, I would use the 10 in 1 Main Magic and I start flat iron. And that may seem like a lot of items, but when you want to have ultimate protection, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. All right, a new item before I get to the very last item. This is a brand that I have truly been loving. I've been using it during the summertime for when I have my hair in this curly state and it is Aunt Jackie's. This is the flaxseed recipe, but it's not the flaxseed gel. It's called Seal It Up Hydrating Sealing Butter. Now for all you ladies out there who are flat ironing your hair and your hair is feeling a little dry on that third or fourth day, or it starts to seem like it wants to revert back or it's shedding and things like that. This is what you need. I have been searching for something like this and sorry to say, I could only find it on Amazon. It is a butter cream for your hair. Whereas a lot of people like to use like hair grease and things like that, this is a butter cream. And when I say buttery, you see that? It's, it's, it looks like butter very very lightweight I really ooh, yeah mm -hmm. I really really do like this now what I have been doing is since I color my hair my hair likes to get a little dry I just put some of this in my hand I go around my edges in the middle because it's so lightweight it just you know drinks right in and then I put it on the ends of my hair and I mean it feels so soft and I have noticed since I've been using it that my hair hasn't been shedding that much which lets me know it's giving me moisture without making my hair revert back so I really enjoyed that it's about eight dollars None of Aunt Jackie's products are more than $12.99 that I know of unless you get into the oils, but I do suggest and recommend that as a styling item. Last but not least of the uh, hair care items, and I'm just trying to pull some of my hair out of here. <laughs> this is that uh, Con Air Inf Infinite or something like that. Um, blow dryer, what is it? Con Air Infinite Pro Blow Dry Paddle. 
uh, however, I don't, I forgot how they call it, but y'all remember seeing this in the video. Y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all something right now. The cord, nice and long. This is a godsend. Now I've used it one time. Now how many times do you have to use a blow dryer to understand if it works or it doesn't work for you? I feel as though one time. Now it is quite loud and um, the heat on it is for the low setting it's kind of like medium warm if that makes sense to you and I like that the hot setting is medium hot it never got to a point to where I couldn't keep my hand right here because I would go through my hair like this and I would have my hand on it and you know just go straight through like that to blow dry my hair and I loved it it has kind of like a paddle brush I'm trying to get my little hair I shouldn't have did that y'all it has like paddle brush bristles these little ones here and then you have like these little uh, rubberized ones on there as well the heat comes out through this entire paddle right there and um, you have the one button there and like I said it blow dried my hair very well and very fast due to the blow drying spray I would part my hair in four sections I always would start at the back and you know I could just hold my hair and brush it and that's what I like instead of trying to hold a brush and you know kind of do this motion there or take the other blow dryer that I was using that was like a comb built in I could hold my hair and go down and then go up underneath like this. Oh, Lord, I done grab my earring. <laughs> and then go underneath and, you know, get it good and dry. I could split it in the middle and get down in there. I am so glad that I got this. And if you haven't seen my last video, it will be below. But I got this for $18. At Walmart, it is $39 and some change. At CVS, it was $30.27. I had a 40% off coupon, and that's how I was able to get it for $18. I do recommend this, this particular one. I haven't used other brands. I do enjoy this. Baby girl and my other daughters will not be getting their hands on it. I don't care what nobody say. They ain't getting it. So yeah, I love this thing. It will be gone with me when I travel. So I believe that is everything. Let's do a check. Okay, no lipstick on the teeth. That is good. Yeah, I believe that is everything that I wanted to show you. I did nails, I did hair, I did skincare, I did new cameras and things like that. Uh, I showed y'all everything. So I'm going to end this by saying welcome to all the new positive supporters. I appreciate you guys so much. I wish everyone a very happy and blessed new year. And please leave me uh, suggestions of videos that you would like to see in the new year in the comment section below. If, you know, keep it you know clean <laughs> but I definitely want to know what you want to see in the new year do you want to see nail videos hair skin um, I can do tutorials but I think I'm going to post those on uh, Facebook so that you can go look at them at any times you know my videos are already long so that's how we're going to do that the 52 week money challenge I am not going to do a quote unquote intro video for it however I do have some new uh, buckets to save money in I already have money in the buckets for the very first video and that video will be coming out um, 
probably the first Friday in January 2018. If you want to be a part of that, let me know. You want to be a part of the 52 week money challenge and we will go from there to all be blessed. As I always say, wear your makeup, save your money, and Nunu will see you in a few days with the next video. Bye.